Hello, I'm Matt Britton and I'm the president of Google in Africa, the Middle East and Europe. Hi, I'm David Sneddon. I'm VP in Matt's leadership team and the proud executive sponsor of the Disability Alliance in EMEA. So Matt, let me kick this conversation off. Uh, Matt, at Google, we have a clear mission, making information universally accessible for everyone. How does this apply to accessibility and disability inclusion for you? Well, David, when our founders put Google together 22 years ago, that, that mission was really fundamental and it remains super clear at the heart of our sort of DNA today. Think about it for a moment. We wanna organize the world's information to make it universally accessible and useful for everyone. And those words, accessible and for everyone, underpin everything we try to do with our products today, whether it's helping you find answers, get directions, giving people tools and platforms to grow and to learn, really building accessible products for everyone is at the heart of what we try to do. Uh, and to do that, if you want to build products for everyone, then your team needs to represent everyone. So diversity, equity, inclusion in our workplace and creating a, a space where everyone can belong is at the heart of our mission with our people. So putting those two things together, we think we can help to change perception, to destigmatize what it means to have a disability and to allow people who see the diverse perspectives of who we are to amplify what people can do and what they're looking for. We need to identify the barriers that are in their way and we need to figure out how we can help to remove them. Our team is engineers and that's what they love to do to solve uh, problems. So we know that we're in an important position to do this. We recognize our responsibility and we really try to take that seriously. Um, and creating a culture where everyone can thrive. We call it making room for all, uh, so that we really understand how to bring together the community, be more representative, uh, and also to understand difference and to challenge bias, the biases that we all have as we go about our day-to-day -day work. So the network that we have, the employee resource group that you're the sponsor of is so important to us in, in doing that work. But David, let's talk about that role a bit more. What, what do you do in your role as sponsor of that group? Well, thank you, Matt. Well, I must say it's quite different from when I first started a few years ago. Uh, we started with only a handful of employee resource groups. Uh, now we have 21 with even more in the pipeline. We've got we've three X the membership in the last year, which just tells me that there's a there's a lot of interest here. I'm delighted to say we now we now have Google accessibility engineers on the ground here in London, which I think will really start to make a difference. We've also really started to think about not just physical disability, but also neurodiversity as well. For those people with 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 uh, typically different cognitive variations, such as ADHD, autism, bipolar conditions, etc., we're trying to create an inclusive family for 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 everybody in this space. So to do, make an even better job of this, which is of course why we're here today, uh, we've recently joined Purple Space, and we're delighted to see a bunch of our offices in, in our region at the beginning of December uh, getting involved in the Purple Light Up. Uh, which I think is really exciting. So I suppose, Matt, what I take from this is that our ERG is, is starting to really connect with people who may not have had a voice previously. Mm. And that's important to Google because we're a company that really prizes inclusivity for all of our incredible people. And maybe, if I may, e even more important for us as human beings. You know, we're, we're in a community where the ambition is a place where employees feel safe, they feel supported, uh, and they can be their very best self. It's reflected, as you said, in our mission statement. So it takes time, it takes passion. We've got a lot of work to do, uh, but uh, if, we, if we work together and with Purple Space, we can really make a difference. Oh, definitely. So Matt, sadly our time is over. Uh, huge thanks to you for being part of this conversation and uh, really wanna thank Purple Space for uh, having us here. Yeah, thanks David and thanks everyone for joining us.